You may have noticed over the past few years that you've had some teeth moving or shifting. Considering that your teeth are anchored into your jawbone, it may be a little tough to imagine that teeth are moving around just without any kind of braces or orthodontic treatment. But teeth shifting can happen for a number of different reasons, not just including taking off your braces and not wearing your retainers. Not only that, but this shift, if left untreated, can lead to tooth pain, jaw pain, and even pain radiating through your neck area. If you've noticed a shift in your smile, it's helpful to know that this is something that can happen to everyone. It's something that's very normal. But in some cases, you may benefit from some guidance from a dental professional. Hi, I'm Dr. William Park from Bless Smile and Smile On You Dentistry. Today, we'll be talking about teeth movement, about how teeth shift, why this occurs, and what you can do to prevent it from getting worse. So how do teeth shift? It may seem like your teeth are anchored inside your bone, but it's not exactly like a nail inside of a wall. It has some give to it. And this is due to a network of connective tissue and fibers called the periodontal ligament. The periodontal ligaments are a series of fibers which act kind of like a bridge to hold on to your tooth, connecting it from the bone to the tooth. While this ligament is very durable and holds your tooth very firmly, it does have some give to it, which is why when you bite down on something very hard, your teeth and bone don't break because you've got some give to the fibers. But this also makes it prone to some mobility of the teeth. But why does this movement occur? According to the American Association of Orthodontics, teeth do naturally move and shift over time but certain stressors can trigger more significant movements that may be harmful. Teeth naturally and gradually move as you age, where your teeth tend to move toward the midline of your mouth. But also, changes in tooth shape, whether that's due to acid erosion, some kind of dental filling, or maybe even grinding, can also cause your teeth to shift as well. Or another possibility is, unfortunately, if you've ever lost a tooth, it's very possible that teeth may be moving in to fill that space or down to fill that space. Can you do anything to prevent this teeth shifting? Well, as we discussed, some minor movements of the teeth is very normal and natural. But if you have any major complications like tooth loss, natural overcrowding, misaligned bite, or crooked teeth, an orthodontist may be able to help prevent further movement. Treatments can run the spectrum from braces, to a retainer, or even possibly a night guard. It all depends on the reason for the movement and how severe the movement is. If you've just finished wearing your braces and finished your orthodontic treatment, but stop wearing your retainers and notice some minor movement, it may be as simple as wearing your retainer every day again. The reality is that there is no treatment that is guaranteed to permanently solve your crooked teeth. But if you're concerned about some subtle shifting, make an appointment with your dentist to speak about your options. Your commitment to your own straight teeth is really the only thing that can safeguard your straight smile. You really do need to pay extra attention to keeping your oral hygiene routines, making sure you're wearing your retainers, and making sure you're following up with your dental checkups. So thank you for watching. I hope that did give you some more insight about why your teeth may be shifting and what you can do about it. If you have any specific concerns, please reach out to me. You can message me on YouTube or on Instagram and I can give you some more information about braces, Invisalign, or any other questions that you may have. Thank you.